We've got these three Akatar spin-off books that are coming out with two novellas. Novellas. We'll see if those wind up to be books too. Um, and they might, might, maybe, maybe. I won't tell you guys who the first one's about. Um, and let me. I don't know when we're gonna announce what this. Okay, the first. Can I tell you guys how these spin-offs happened? Like it was not a planned thing, but. I think it was a cut like two years ago, maybe like a year and a half ago. I was starting to work on Aqua War and it hit me that like, oh shit, this is like the last book with these characters and I'm not I'm not ready to say goodbye. And I started thinking about like, you know, the stories that would happen after Aqua War ended. Just like like basically like doing like fanfic in my own head. Um, and then I began writing one of these stories. Um, and 250 pages later, I was like, oh god, I actually really love this thing and it's turning out to be a real book. Um, and then I thought about all the other stories I wanted to tell that could be possible books. Um, and they would all be kind of like spin-offs, but like, like so they would be like standalones with like different romantic pairings in each one, but together would form kind of like a backbone that could be like united, maybe. Um, but I told no one, I told no one that I was working on these books. Like it was just like my thing that I did for fun. Like when my deadlines, like when I'd like done my contractual work for the day, I'd be like, well, it's time for me to pour a glass of wine and start my fanfic of my own work. Um, <laughs> and so I would do it and it was just like this thing I did. And then a year ago, like, like literally like a year ago, I was at BookCon in Chicago and I went out to dinner with my editor, just me and her and I had a lot of adult beverages, and um, I like drunkenly like confessed to her, like, oops, I've been writing this book, and let me tell you about this book, plus like, you know, all the other ones that I want to have planned. Um, and like, the next morning I woke up and like didn't remember that I said anything. <laughs> and I felt bad for everyone in this fancy restaurant that night, because I was just like rambling about, like I'm sure they were like, what is this insane person talking about? Uh, but I. I woke up the next morning, thought nothing of it, and like a week later I got a phone call from my agent and was like, so I just got a call from your editor saying she wants to buy some books you pitched her. <laughs> and I was like, oh yeah. Um, <laughs> it wasn't like an official pitch or anything, I just was like, Kat, let me ramble to you about like how much I love these characters. Um, and so we wound up selling my publisher through those books and the novellas and um, some of them will take place after Akawar, some might take place before. Um, so you'll see, I am, like I know the, what the first two will be about. Um, and then, like I say three novels, but like, there's so many stories I want to tell in this world, you guys. There are too many characters that I'm like obsessed with. Um, so we'll see, we'll see what happens. So I'm like, I'm excited for them. I think they'll start coming out in 2018. Um, yeah, and I like deliberately, with Aquawar, I deliberately left some, like a lot of the threads open in that book. Um, one, because I, I didn't want like it to feel like everyone like lived happily ever after and everything was perfect. Um, I wanted some stories to still be open because that's kind of how life is. Like no one's story, like none of our stories ever end, they just keep going. Um, but I also like wanted to like set some of these things up. Um, and I made my publisher add that page at the end of Aquawar that's like, like you literally turn like, from the end to like, you know, the series continues in 2018. I was like, we need to add that in case people are like, is this it? Um, yeah. <laughs> um, but I'm not, I know, I, know, I like, made, I was like, it needs to be in a big font. <laughs> but I think it'll be out in fall of 2018, maybe. Don't take my word on any of the deadline and like dates things. Never believe me on that. We'll see. We'll see when that comes out. But I mean, it says in the book 2018, so I think we're on track for that. But don't take my word for it. <laughs> we'll see. But I like. I'm like. Like the first book that's coming out, like the one that I wrote 250 pages of. Like I am freakishly obsessed with that one. So hopefully you will be too. <laughs>